Hi guys, it's Victoria and welcome to today's video. So in this video, I'm going to give you 20 things that you can do at home while you're bored, um, if you're watching this in the future, or while you're quarantined now because what else do we have to do? We can't leave the house. So here are my tips. If you see me looking over, I'm looking at the list that I have written down by the way so that I don't like forget things. So my first activity is to change something with your clothes, like whether you are changing a shirt or like pants, whether you're like tie dyeing it, or cutting it, doing something different. I just think like, like in a thrift flip sense, but like with your own clothes that you already have. My second tip is to do laundry because we all know we can let it pile up sometimes and we really just don't want to do it. Um, but you know, sometimes you just gotta do it, you just gotta put it up, you just gotta put it in the washer, whatever stage of laundry doing you're at. Um, I suggest just getting it done because it gives you something to do and it can take a good portion of time. My third tip is to watch Netflix because we all know we can get invested in that and it can take up quite some time, so. It's definitely a big one. Four is to play board games because I feel like that's something that like we kind of forget about nowadays and like it's actually something really fun like you know playing a board game with your family or your friends whenever you're not quarantined but in this case with your family like it can be really fun and it gives you something to do and if you play something like Monopoly you're going to be playing that game for days. Also if you hear screaming I apologize it's children outside. Also, you can go on a run or a walk, which is something that we have been doing every day because it's one of the only things we can do to get out of the house. So yeah, if you have a dog, walk a dog. Um, if you wanna go on a run, get a little workout in. Go on a run, get a workout in. Um, yeah, it's definitely, it's a good activity. It gets you exercise while you're stuck in isolation all day, um, but also it, gets you out of the house. I apologize if the background changed or like the positioning of the camera changed because I just had to change my battery so I think it's a little different but I'm not for sure. Okay, number six is to work out because when you're inside all day and you're in isolation, you get bored, you eat, you lose some of the muscle you've been working on. All the gyms are closed, you know. But you can do workouts at home. There are so many channels that show like workouts. Um, you know, you can find so many different workouts and you can get a variety of different things every single day. Number seven is to do your makeup. Um, I find that it's something really fun and it's really time consuming. Um, so anything time consuming is one of my favorite things to do while I'm quarantined because I get so bored um, and I want something to take up a huge chunk of time. So if you do your makeup that takes a long time and you can experiment, have fun because you have all the time in the world, you know, you can do whatever the heck you want to do. You can learn a TikTok dance. That is something very fun to do. It's also a workout in its own, um, but it'll take a while and it's super fun. And yeah, I think that learning TikTok dances are really sick, so. You can go online shopping, which um, I probably shouldn't be telling you to do this, but we all know it's super fun and we all love online shopping. And if we can't go out, might as well do it inside, you know? Number 10 is to FaceTime your friends. That's something you can still have human interaction, you know, you can still hang out with your friends just virtually. Luke and I have been FaceTiming every day because we can't see each other, so that's something that I suggest and it's a good way to still communicate with your friends and almost be together. You can use this time to start a YouTube channel if that's something you wanna do. Um, I think if you want to do it, then just go for it. And this is the perfect time because you're stuck in the house and you can spend all of your time devoting it to YouTube and you can really grind it out and work super hard. Um, 
that's something I've been doing. I've been working um, really hard on my channel and working really hard on producing good content and spending a lot of time editing and working on my thumbnails and doing stuff that like, so that I haven't like done before really. Like I'm working super duper hard and I did work hard before but I didn't like push this hard, you know? You can also go take Instagram pictures, whether it's by yourself or having somebody take them with you. Um, like, you can always set up a timer and take pictures. Or on my birthday, I had Michael, who's my little brother. We went out um, into the country where there's nobody around, so we didn't have to worry about getting sick. Sorry, that's my guinea pig. We didn't have to worry about getting sick and... Um, so we went out there and he took pictures for me for my Instagram and it was super fun and um, yeah, it's really fun to do plus it boosts your content so I highly recommend. You can make snacks for when you are bored eating and then you can eat your snacks and you can have something super good to eat. Um, I love making snacks. I recently, the other day, made ants on a log but without the ants because I don't like raisins but ants on a log is just... Um, chopped up celery with peanut butter in it and then raisins on top but I don't like raisins so I just did the celery and peanut butter and it was super good and it's just something that like takes up time and then it's kind of like rewarding when you eat your snack because you're like oh I did this like oh. you know it's like putting some work into it you can also clean whatever it is you can clean your room you can clean your desk you can clean your bathroom you can clean your shoes off you know, whatever you want to do, you can clean. Um, I actually, my last video is me cleaning my room. So if you want to go check that out, go ahead. It'll be up here somewhere, whatever side it is. But yeah, I definitely recommend cleaning. Um, it's good for the soul. <laughs> you know, it's good for your mind because, like, you have it done. You can play with a pet. Recently, Wilson and I, Wilson is my guinea pig in case you didn't know, but recently we have been really doing a whole lot of bonding and you know he's been out with me all the time he's peed on me several times you know epic um but yeah we've really been bonding i've also been playing with my dogs a lot it's just super fun and you know they love it you love it it's just some bonding time you can learn something new whether it's a language or um a dance or a skill anything um i think learning something new is always really important especially when your mind is kind of just like because you're just sitting inside all day um so it's definitely important to learn something and stimulate your brain and keep yourself like learning and stuff um especially if when you're if you are doing online school um Sometimes it's like you're not really learning anything, but also if you're not doing online school, it's definitely really important to keep yourself doing things and occupied and stuff like that. You can draw or paint, which is something that I really like to do. Um, I like to draw a lot, even though I'm not good at it, but you don't have to be good at it to do it. I mean, it doesn't matter. Nobody's going to see it if they don't, like if you don't make them see it, you know? So, um... You know, you can draw for fun, and you can work on your skills. If you're bad at drawing, maybe you'll get good at drawing after this quarantine. Make a to-do list and do it all. It is so rewarding to get it all done. Like, I, the past week, I've been making a to-do list every single day, like, either the night before or that morning, and then I just make sure I get all of it done. I just mark everything off as I get through it, and it is so, it's such a good feeling, and it's so satisfying to, like, mark everything off your to-do list. 19 is to go for a drive if that is allowed in your area I know in my area we can if we're not like going out you know like I can just go drive around town and stuff and it gets you out of the house um but you're contained in your car so it's not like you'll be getting sick you know but it's something to do and you can listen to music you can just jam out and it's just some time to yourself too 20 is to watch my videos if you're bored. I don't mean to plug myself, but I do have this channel and I also have a vlog channel which is always linked down below and you can go check out those videos as well because over the summer I did vlog every single day which was a pain in the butt, but I did get it done and um, there's a lot of content on there and there's a lot of content on here if you want to spend some time watching it and give yourself something to do, but obviously you don't have to if you don't want to. I'm just 
giving you an option. Okay guys, so that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed and if you did, be sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below because I post videos every Sunday and um, you can also subscribe to my vlog channel which is down below. Um, I've been trying to push a lot of content out because I've been vlogging almost every day um, but it's not always enough to like daily vlog. I'm trying to upload more frequently and stuff like that so yeah um if you want to check it out go ahead if you don't want to don't um but yeah i hope you enjoyed this video and i'll see you in the next one